A high limit thermostat is a switch that is actuated by temperature change. If your dryer does not heat at all, you should test the thermostat for continuity at room temperature. A continuity test will determine if a continuous electrical path is present in the thermostat. At room temperature, the thermostat should have continuity. No continuity means the electrical path is broken and the thermostat has failed. You can choose from a variety of multimeters to perform the test. For this demonstration, we will use both analog and digital models. When using an analog model, first rotate the range selection dial to the lowest setting for ohms of resistance. Then calibrate the meter by pinching the probes together while adjusting the needle to read zero. When using a digital model, again rotate the dial to the lowest setting for ohms of resistance or resistance with tone if your meter has this option. Before you begin, make sure the thermostat has been removed or isolated from the appliance. Now, use a probe to touch one of the thermostat's terminals and the second probe to touch the other terminal. If the meter reading shows zero ohms of resistance, the thermostat has continuity. If the meter's needle does not move or the digital display does not change significantly, there is no continuity, which means the thermostat has failed and will need to be replaced. While the thermostat should display continuity at room temperature, it should switch off or display no continuity when heated. If the thermostat does not switch off when heated or switches off prematurely, your dryer could potentially overheat or heat improperly. A high limit thermostat will switch off between 250 and 300 degrees Fahrenheit, depending on the thermostat. Refer to the designation printed on the part itself. To test the thermostat's response to temperature change, place the component on an electric griddle or skillet and set the heat to the appropriate temperature. If the thermostat switches off within 5% of that temperature, the part is functioning properly. If the thermostat does not switch off or switches off prematurely, the thermostat is faulty and will need to be replaced.